I'm gonna eat. I am gonna eat grass, and roots before before I burn my picture of Lee. And if I can avoid it, I'd like to avoid you know burning my picture of Kenny and Katja and Duck. Burn log. Please tell me I don't have to burn anything else. Please tell me I don't have to burn. Oh, great. I'm gonna get separated from Krista, aren't I? Poor Clementine. <laughs> She's so vulnerable. Playing as her versus playing as Lee, it's just so much different because of how vulnerable she is. Don't fucking lie to us. Who do you think you're fooling? Give us the truth and you don't get hurt. <gasps> Where's the rest of your group? I, I'm by myself. Bullshit. She's lying. Cut the shit, lady. <gasps> it's it's just me. What the Krista, fuck? Krista, run! Hey! <laughs> Oh no. I hope Krista made it. Get the fuck over here! Now! Fucker. Oh my gosh. Clementine's gonna be all by herself. Here, girl, I'm not fucking around. Look, girl. Shit! Get the fuck over here! God damn it! Quick time's a little different. Gotta stay on my toes. Come on, Clementine. Jesus, are you fucking kidding me? Oh, she's feisty. Come on, Clementine. Leave me alone! Stop fucking running! Oh, Q, 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 Q! Oh, come on, Clem. Oh, Clem! Get off of me, you punk! Oh! Jesus, are you fucking kidding me? She's just a little girl. Come on, dude! Come on! Oh my gosh, come on! Oh! Oh jeez, all I can do is run, I don't have a gun. Ah. And I don't even know what happened to Krista. The river runs cold. I think it's safe to say that her baby really didn't make it, because otherwise her baby would be here with us. This is depressing, you guys! This is like episode three of season one all over again, almost. Chris So Clementine is now about nine and a half. I want to say nine. I'm sorry, ten and a half. Ten and a half. Hello? It's canoe over there. Junior something? I couldn't I couldn't read it in time. Oh, somebody's over there. 
probably a walker. This is so sad. Clem is all by herself now. I mean, granted, she's ten, but still. Ten and a half. Can you get up there? <sighs> Come on, try again. There you go. I'm really afraid about what I'm going to find. I don't think Krista made it. She looked like she had lost her will to live. I think the only thing keeping her going is just protecting Clementine. Look at the grave. There's a grave there and there's a trail. All right, we're going to look at the grave. Yeah, I think after losing Omid and losing her baby, the only thing that's keeping her going is Clementine. And if Clementine's gone, she's probably not going to fight anymore. In that split second, I had to distract them. I had to try to save Krista if I could. I, Clementine would have definitely done that. She would not have... She would have been scared, but she would have done anything to keep Krista safe. Just like, just like she knows that Krista would have done anything she could to keep Clementine safe, you know? They're pretty much a team. And they have to. Be aware of your surroundings. Black bears. Great. Just great. Bears. Lions, tigers, and all that good stuff. Come on, Clemmy. That's right, I can hold shift to run. Forgot about that. This place goes forever. Sheesh. How in the heck is she going to find Krista here? If she is here. Alright, there's rustling in the... Oh! Expect that to happen a lot, guys. I am probably one of the most jumpy... The jumpiest people you're going to meet. It's a tail. I don't think that's human. It's a dog with a Sam. Oh, dog. It's okay, boy. It's okay. So, where are your owners? Are they around? If they are, I hope they're nice. What's he doing? Hey, what'd you find, boy? Where are you going? Wait up! Sam is the dog's name. Okay. We'll go with this for now. What's the worst that could happen? Shelter. Oh, is that the camp? Is his owner dead? He looks pretty run over, but you never know. Oh, you're so hungry. Let's look around for some food. I 
I doubt that there's going to be anything in these boxes, but we're going to look. Um, can I not look? Oh, it's the family. There's the dog. Looks like they were a happy family once. I hope they left some food behind somewhere. Oh, it's dolls and toys. Hmm, nothing edible. No, not so much. Clemens times like doesn't care about dollies anymore. She's she's grown up. She just wants. Think anyone's been sleeping in here? I can't tell. Maybe we better not wait around to find out. Well, Clementine's already picking up the whole. She's already taking after Lee with the whole talking to herself thing. I think it's very cute. Hey, wanna play? Wanna play catch? Okay, bring it back. Thank you, Sam. You're a good dog. Good boy. Good boy. <sighs> Empty. Better keep looking, boy. Yeah. Not much of a tent anymore. I bet scavengers tore it apart. Yeah, that's. I don't think. I don't think the people are still here. Did that? Hey, boy. What's the matter? Did that walker with a sign in her head look like the wife? Look like the mom? I feel like it was. We have to be quiet. Yeah, I think it was probably the mom that we saw earlier. Which means the rest of her family is probably not too far off. I doubt there's going to be anything in this cooler. Oh, God. Oh. <coughs> I'm so sick of that smell. Yeah. Talk to the dog. Oh, no. It's okay. He's dead. Look. You can see the bite. Looks like he tried to cut it out. But that never works. Ever. He's tied up to the tree now. It's okay. We're smart and he's not. We're smarter than all of them. That's what Lee said. Grab the knife. Grab the knife. Look at the knife. Can I use something? That looks like it hurt. Hmm. Hey, it's okay, boy. Shh. He can't hurt us. Think he had himself tied up? Or did someone force him to do this? Mm. Pick up the branch. Stand back, okay? Smash him. Come on, Clem. Smash him again. Come on, Clem, you've done this before. One more time, dear. One more time for good measure. There we go. Just to be safe, there's his brain. See, we just have to stay out of their reach. Smart, Clem, very smart. Search 
Well, let's get the knife first. Always the weapon first. That's what Lee said. Then search pockets. <sighs> Still pretty sharp. At least we found something useful. Yeah. We won't go another night without food, okay? Can I at least search his pockets? Do I not get that option? Uh, I guess I don't get that option. I'm assuming that means there wasn't anything really in the pockets that was useful, so. Good on you, Clem. Glad you're... <laughs> your brains alone is what's keeping you alive. Oh. No food here, either. Yeah, I think this camp is long gone, Clem. Here we go. Oh, really? <gasps> oh my god. Thank you. Look, a can. <gasps> Let's see what's inside. Hopefully it's something that you can actually eat without getting sick. Family style. Probably beans. 1978? Please don't be bad. It looks pretty good to me, whatever it is. It looks like beans. Beans? <sighs> Thank God. I guess you are pretty hungry too. Yeah, he's our companion. We gotta share. Here you go. Hey, you don't eat it all. Oh. Oh my gosh. Oh. Oh my gosh. Sam. He was just that hungry. Oh, that's tough. He was just hungry. Uh, poor thing. I can't leave him that way. Come on. He's suffering. I'm sorry. Game. Oh, jeez, that's quite a bite, Clem. You're gonna have to... It's not from a walker, though. Hopefully nobody will think it's from a walker. But we need to dress that wound or something. This is rough, you guys. This is only, this is only episode one! This is just episode one! I thought we found someone who could be our friend, and again, there's always people coming and going in Clementine's life. That, how hard is that? People constantly coming and going. I just can't even imagine. Just can't even imagine. It's okay, you can cry, Clem. I know. 
She has nobody. She's all by herself. She's wounded. She doesn't have anything to dress her wound with. It might get infected. This is really... This is like... Rock bottom, almost. What? Oh no. She's getting dizzy. Oh no. Seriously? Okay, this is rock bottom. Clammy? She's not feeling very well either. I don't know. This is so way too much for a ten and a half year old girl who is who is alone. I'm trying to run. I'm trying to run. Oh, go, 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 go. oh dear lord. Dear lord, I can't press too long enough. Oh. I hope they don't think that she got bit by a walker. That's my big that's my big fear. They might think that it's a walker that bit her. On the path. I think I think we're safe. Yeah, yeah, we're good. Hey, you all right? I... I think so. The guy in the... What are you doing out here? Where are the, uh, the people you're with? There's no chance you made it this long on your own. I don't want them thinking we're doing anything but trying to help you. My friend and I got attacked. Hmm. These folks mentioned what they were after? They might have just wanted food. We were cooking some sort of weasel. They attacked you for a weasel? Damn. That is low. They didn't mention any names, right? They weren't searching for anybody? Hmm. Well, I'm Luke. And this is Pete. Luke. Hey there. Okay. Hi. I'm Clementine. And it's nice to meet you, Clementine. But for now, we're gonna take you back to our group. Okay, we got a doctor with us, and you look like you could use some- Oh, shit! Ah! What? What is it? She's- She's been bit, man. Fuck. Fuck, fuck, fuck. What are we gonna do here? No, it was a dog. I didn't see any dog, Clementine. Come on, kid. We just saw you with those lurkers back there. It was. I swear. Swearing doesn't make something so. No, no, no. I'm telling you the truth. Please. I knew it. I knew they wouldn't. Hmm. All right. Let's see. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, watch yourself. Hey, don't look at me like that. You're the one that's bit here, okay? See? Is it, uh, is it like she says? Hmm. Well, it could be a dog. Hard to say. So where'd this dog go? The one that did this? Now, what, what does that matter, Pete? Serious? I... I killed it. What? Really? A dog shows up and bites you and you just kill it? What would you have done? I don't know. It attacked me. Still, you don't... You don't kill dogs. Clementine? Yes? You telling us the truth? You look me in the eyes when you answer. Yes. All right, Clementine. That's good enough for me. Well, what else was she gonna say? 
I've got a good bullshit detector, Luke. That's why you can never beat me at poker. <laughs> you don't always beat me at it. All right, how can you be sure? Well, I'm sure I ain't willing to leave a little girl in the woods to die when we got a doctor with us that can make a call. We can have Carlos take a look at it first. Nick ain't gonna like this. Not with what happened. You don't have to remind me of that, boy. Right. Sorry, sir. Come on. I understand Luke's concern. Pete handled that pretty well, but I understand Luke's concern because she could have been. Clementine, are you feeling all right? I'm fine. Just tired. Well, you better be fine, because I ain't carrying you anymore with that bite on your arm. Don't worry about. Ah, oh, shit. She, I mean, they don't know her, so she could have been lying. Carver? She already told us that she and her friend were attacked. Then she was bitten by a dog. What? And you just believed her? You should have put her out of her misery right there. Dog bite my ass. I need a dog. <gasps> Keep your finger off the trigger, boy. Whoa! Whoa! What the you fuck? You idiot! Every lurker for five miles probably heard You're the that. one telling me to fucking shoot her. Everybody just calm down for a second. Clementine, you okay? I just need a doctor. And then, and then I'll go. I don't want my arm to get infected. None of us want to get infected. That's the point. We got a doctor right here, okay? He'll have a look. Now what the hell is wrong with you people? Okay, she's just scared. We're all scared, Luke. Don't act like we're the ones being irrational because we don't buy this bullshit story. No way she survived out here on her own. Why are we even arguing about this? Let me take a look. I hope the doctor can tell the difference between a... A uh, walker bite and a dog bite. It's okay. Go ahead. He's a doctor. Thank you, Luke. Luke's starting to warm up to me now. Damn, that must have hurt. Hmm. Whatever it was, it got you good. This isn't how we do things, man. When you're bit, you get put down. End of story. I'm not going through this again. No one's suggesting that. We could take her arm off. <gasps> uh, I know that worked for a cousin down in Ainsworth. We could try that. It won't do any good. You'll just be making it worse for the girl. It's crazy. No one's going to volunteer to do that. I would. Sad eyes. <laughs> Sad eyes. <laughs> I'm on your side, kid. No need for a guilt trip. Who's she? Sarah. What I say, stay inside. I don't mean to be any trouble. I just want to stop the bleeding and then I'll go. You'll never see me again, I promise. And where exactly would you go? I can take care of myself. Clearly. Look, I may be in the minority here, but my gut tells me she's telling the truth. It probably is just a dog bite. Probably. So, what do you think? Was it a lurker? A bite like that could be anything. Only one way to find out. How? Oh. We wait. What? By tomorrow morning, if the fever set in, we'll know if she's gonna turn. In the meantime, we can lock her in the shed. 